Hey, what's going on guys? It is Dibes, Mr. Crockpot on Twitter. Today we are counting down my top five wide receivers in the 2024 NFL draft, guys. If you love the draft and you want more draft content, please be sure to subscribe. Let's go. Coming in number five in my rankings is Xavier Worthy out of Texas. It was a relatively down year for Xavier Worthy in 2022, whose 70.1 receiving grade per PFF was 10 points lower than what he posted in 2021 as a true freshman. Despite seeing 10 more targets this past season, the sophomore recorded 224 fewer receiving yards and four fewer touchdowns than his dominant 2021 campaign. He became much more of a downfield receiver this past year, with his average depth of target being 17.6 yards, which ranks seventh highest in the Power Five. That dwarfs his 13.4 yard figure from 2021, which was 69th in the same group. By making Worthy a more downfield threat, Texas took away of one of his best attributes, his ability after the catch. As a true freshman, Worthy's 526 yards after the catch was the 10th most in the Power Five. He fell to 41st this past year with only 324 yards after the catch. Let's watch some highlights. Coming in number four in my rankings is Rome Adunze out of Washington. Here is a six foot three, 211 pound junior who had 75 catches for over 1,100 yards and seven touchdowns in 2022. Outside of the Ohio State duo, Odunze is the most productive returning Power 5 receiver. The junior's 605 yards against single coverage trailed only Marvin Harrison Jr. among that group. He's also the third most valuable returning Power 5 receiver according to PFF's win above average metric. Roma Dunze is a true complete three-level threat. He's a smooth athlete and separator, an instinctive contested catch savant, and an elusive run after the catch weapon. Roma Dunze has potential to put up some monster stats in 2023. Let's watch some highlights. Coming in number three in my rankings is Malik Neighbors out of LSU. Malik Neighbors, the next in the Tigers line of wide receiver prospects, is a good bet to deliver on his upside. Neighbors is a legit speed threat downfield who can offset and stack defensive backs with ease. He has unnatural run after the catch ability for his size, and he's an adept contortionist to the football. He reached 1,000 yards receiving last season and played his best ball in his final few games. Malik Neighbors is an athletic powder keg and a stack specialist as a route runner who can effortlessly flow to passes with his hands. After the catch, he has size-defying contact balance and run after the catch ability. Let's watch some highlights.
Coming in number two in my rankings is Emeka Abuka out of Ohio State. Emeka Abuka was the second most viable Power 5 receiver last season, according to PFF's win above average metric. The only one more viable was his teammate Marvin Harrison Jr. Among returning Power 5 receivers, only Harrison tallied more receiving yards and touchdowns than Abuka. He's a smooth route runner who should be one of the top weapons in 2023. Emeka Abuka actually bears some similarity to Jackson Smith and Jigba, my number one receiver in the 2022 draft. He's six foot one, 205 pounds, a nuanced separator with excellent short area agility and change of direction, but he's more visibly explosive than his predecessor. Let's watch some highlights. Coming in number one in my wide receiver rankings is Marvin Harrison Jr. out of Ohio State. Being a Hall of Famer's son can generate an exorbitant amount of pressure, but Marvin Harrison Jr. has already proven he can handle it. Early on, he looks like a blue chip NFL prospect in the mold of an AJ Green or a DeAndre Hopkins. He's a six foot four, 205 pound weapon who makes separating look easy and his ability to convert as a catcher is unmatched. This is a guy who has all the size and athleticism you're looking for in a star wide receiver in the NFL. He's an elite catcher of the football with hands of steel, and he has the route nuance and flexibility to win one-on-ones against defensive backs three to four inches shorter. If his 2023 campaign goes as projected, you can expect Marvin Harrison Jr. to be in top five consideration in the 2024 NFL Draft. So those are my top five wide receivers in the 2024 NFL Draft. Did I miss anybody? Who are some of your favorite wide receivers? Let me know down in that comment section below. Please like this video and subscribe for more draft content. Thank you everyone for watching. Stay awesome.